That's what RAG is, which stands for Retrieval Augmented Generation. So say you have a client and then they have this large document of text that they have these customers that ask them the same questions over and over and they come to you and they say, I want to build a question and answering system for this document because I don't want to answer all the questions over and over. So what you can do is use something like RAG. RAG grabs the document they gave you and you can break up the document into chunks. You label those chunks based on what questions they answer. When a user asks a question, RAG will get those chunks from something like a you'd store them in the vector database and then it grabs those chunks, it sends it to a large language model with the question and it comes back with an answer. That's what RAG is which stands for Retrieval Augmented Generation. They do this to make the model more accurate so it doesn't hallucinate or generate wrong answers. It is used for tasks like question answering, summarization, and chatbots that require reliable, up-to-date information. And using something like RAG, it gives the model the ability to access new and relevant contexts to answer the user's question.